That thing is such a nuisance to kill on Team Fight. That's an interesting rolling boulder from Jirax. He was getting away. Uh, now the jump burning. Not really too quick to get himself out of this. Just the spin being committed again. Another blink skewer. Wow. That had to barely be off the tail of S4. S4 missed that coil, so he almost caught XSS in that coil. He didn't want to turn and cast a coil behind him. He wanted to cast it in front of him, and because of that, he narrowly, narrowly missed. The they bag. fortify up. You're still not ready to find with OG. You're just short of it. There's not even 100 gold to get that ready. The tower denied up. No tail. Able to get that one, but S4 cops a formly slash from the Juggernaut. Still get a tower at the eye, and OP committed most of his mana to try and Go on. Saw him come in and waited with a trap. S4, however, looking for some revenge. He hasn't managed to bring down the Ricky just yet. It's OP who's the primary target. Concoction, it cannot be disjointed. That's why Jerex can just roll forward, look for another silence. So kick it once he got. He turns on the magnetize instead. OP, one more jump available. He gets back to where the T1 tower used to be, but now in comes S4. Over from the side. Q, is it time for the rock? He's got the golem available. And now OG, they have to switch targets once again. Q just wants to TP out this one. He's not going to drop the rock, and instead it's moving towards XX. The stun, the silence, where is that stun? It's going to miss. He only hits the silence and Anna, no mana. So incapable of throwing at another concoction. Wow, that was a huge play by uh, Q there. He got the Fatal Bonds on the Puck before this actually, before he TP'd out and died. And because of the Fatal Bonds, he disabled the Puck blink and he tried to, he tried to waning rift him before the Puck was able, or before the Magnus was able to get out. That was really clutch. If he didn't have the Fatal Bonds, that would have been like, what, three deaths, I would say? Coming around the agents, but S4 has the invis rune. He was looking for original kill, and now phase shift orb and blink away. Destroys the gank that was coming in from IG, but OP wants to keep going. Fly had to turn around to help out S4. Defensive disruption will be there, and as Puck will come back in, burning, spinning. S4, he can't blink away, but he can orb up at the oh. shot wave. Madness reads it perfectly. The observer one gave them action. Okay, they call it an illusion. Invictus Gaming, the Puck, he jumped into the middle of the smoke screen. The ball star found the rock will fall. S4 able to get both of his combo off, so maybe the control will still be there with a kick flying in from Jirak. Open. Heavy burst eyes are quick enough. He went for the plus three. The storm is are... No one else gonna follow. No, they really just don't exist anymore. Oh. Thing, but in this game, it's it's huge. OG, it's the first big opening they've got to do damage inside the base. But be careful. The RP, you're ending up in XXS as well now, especially when Alchemist orchid it up and silenced up. There goes your first man to push back out for the RP. It'll catch her. Drag him in. It's S4 plus no tail. The phase shift will end up saving one, but no S4 will she come back out. No, where's your extra help? Just keep spamming more illusions. But they've done the damage. They've taken the tier three towers out at least. They just have to get out in their current state. Goes the save for OG, and then just trying to. Re <laughs> XXS, he got the glorious whole polarity out, and it has to buy back. They need to keep this contest going. XXS will die for his sins committed against the OG tribunal. Burning wants to keep running. Another concoction stun. They are going to bring him down. These are going to be big kills. Burning going in for the spin. Anna, they're actually trying to go for doubles here. But with the help of S4, he is able to get it. Uh, 882 gold for that kill on Burning. He's worth a lot, but so is this space. Opening up and out around Roshan. And let's see it again. Anna, Fly, and no tell. They all just wanted to go home. He is really got a Mima. He subscribes to the Book of Loner. <laughs> well, so Roshan's up. Yep. Dyer knows it. Radiant yep. is gonna know very yeah, soon. It's, it's max spawn time. Every, just, everyone knows it it's, now. It's only been 10, so it's not quite max spawn. Oh, oh, the RP. They find Anna. Anna does have the regeneration up. You'll see if he has enough damage. The Orchid keeping Jirax out of the fight, but still, the damage is not enough. You've got him surviving. Flying's got a little bit more to help out. Not to mention the Purge throwing it down on Burning the Break. He'll have to BKB trying to find Anna. Still remaining healthy. Doesn't have any kind of armor to toggle through this one, but no tell. But no metamorphosis. The damage is just scary. And that's why Burning straight TP out. Boom. So. I'm wondering if you start chipping away the range racks as well, or if the tier 3 towers are your primary Please. thing. Why not all three? <laughs> yeah, Why not all three lanes? Why not two T3s and range racks at the same time? They have enough illusions to oh, do so. Uh, Adam. 
Bovica's nearby. OP would love to go for the jump out, but there's no real opening for it. He can at least clean up the creep wave that was on bottom. As S4, <laughs> long range and very quick maneuvering from the puck. He can jump between lanes. I guess he's almost six ladder right now, so he doesn't actually need the DPM too much on the puck. It's pretty cool. He just wants to be able to control control the mag or control the storm. This is the most important menu up on our, up on our screen right now. That buyback menu. The three cores from Invictus Gaming can all come back up again. And there's only 800 shy for Wall and Ricky to pick up their buybacks. OP gunning for oh, fly. A long jump out. Does he have enough damage? He should fly your pop from this one. The Orchid. I say the Orc and it's the full blood bolt, but the Hex return. Rocks will fall, but it comes a little bit too late. Now it's OG on the aggression. XXS is forced back out. He's still stunned up. He got hit by the Dream Cost. They can't turn around to let NRP go, but he'll have to do it. There's no other choice. Omni Slash, no tally take more of the damage. He's able to do it. Diego Simona will burn. Let's put some metamorphosis back on cooldown. OC, there's your buyback. Looking for the target. S4 up and towards the edge. You also won't save him. There's a big kill. 100 seconds without him and the RP. He's still got that control. OG's losing too many of the front lines. They get no objectives out of this. So much patience from OG, but more patience from Invictus Game. And only one buyback, and that's on the Storm Spirit. Still down nine Bloodstone charges, but finally Exorcist is able to connect on two RPs. And it behind, so Burning isn't buffed. This is your other issue, or is he? Is it going to be the end of his Empower? So they're not clearing through quickly into OG, but without the Puck's initiation, Invictus Gaming has to feel a little bit more confident. So they're going to take a lot of T3 damage. The T3 opens up Shrine. And is that worth a buyback right now? Probably not for them, but not for the Terrorblade. When he's 21 seconds away, you just have enough faith in Anna to do the work. As a spray it up, the pretty cool. XXS so is looking for Jirax. Anna preparing the concoction. He'll have to stun himself once again. Burning can look towards him for the kick from Jirax. Making it so Burning can't initiate. But that melee Rax is falling quickly. He goes six seconds until no tell is back up again. Rax is down and Victor's Gaming. All they have to do is get out now. Burning with the spins, able to do it, straight TP, and Invictus Gaming, it is take. That is. Either that or he's like, you know what, I'm okay, going to get something. a kill. He, he sold his item and now he has he has buyback now. There's only 200 gold short of it though. Uh, he, I, I checked this thing, it said it's like 690, so he had to sell something fairly big. Okay. Oh, well, jump up. They look for the target. The Hex is going to be Jirax, the Earth Spirit in trouble. Alchemist TPing over, but will it still be enough for the Blood Bolt? The damage is there, in fact, now it's the Alchemist in trouble! Two minutes down, no time needs to go huge now. Get himself out of the smoke screen. The disrupt will allow that timing. There was the Blink Ball, the Triple Kill, the Burning, and the RP! That could be the game right there! Have IG done it? Have they got game one against OG? Burning, he wants to put the nail in the coffin. No is back up thanks to his buyback with the hex forward. You can smell it in the air. It's Invictus Gaming, your RP, locking down No Tell. Nowhere to run. Burning will hold it. Smoke screen, nothing more to do but skewer him into the afterlife. OG, they will lose the game after being the first ones to really enter the base, taking the tier 3 towers. But Invictus Gaming,